Hey, it's Zach. Um, did I, yeah, this is my first video on this account. So, don't expect it to be very good, but I'll probably get better soon. And also, I'll, do, I'll, I'll be doing other videos on random things. Alright, so today, I have my Universal TV remote control watch. Which is from Hong Kong. I got it on eBay. $15.99. No postage. Very good. And basically, it has an infrared light here. Oops. And, um, basically, yeah, you can just... Hack, pretty much like sort of hack into TVs and just control them with the touch screen here. It's got little buttons. Can't really see. I haven't got very good focus in this camera. But yeah. So let's show you what. Well, first I'll show you the instructions that it came with. Yeah, wait. Gotta do this all one handed. Like a tripod. Wow. Perfect for the multilingual. So you got some weird Asian language, English, pictures, more Asian languages, and yeah. So basically, this this thing shows in the menu. It's not very informative. It's quite simple, but anyway, let's just find some English. Ah, uh, because since it is from Hong Kong. Uh, Well, it's pretty good actually, it's not that bad. Uh, oh, alright. When equipment has accept your command, please press and release any button. Mm, yeah, it's not that funny. Anyway, that's pretty good. Interestingly enough though, on the back it comes with this table and it shows and it shows all the brands that the T V will work with and each infrared channel to put it on whether it's for a TV, DVD, player, VCR, does a lot of stuff. So pretty much anything, everything from A mark, seems to be the first one, to autofocus. Alright, try again. Autofocus. Alright. But some weird Chinese name anyway, it's all in Chinese characters. So yeah, it's got a lot of stuff. And very big as you can see. And it's pretty good actually, it's got pretty much every brand I can think of. Actually, you know, a lot more brands than I can think of. And the watch is pretty good, it has the clock, it's got a stopwatch. Comes with the correct time, but incorrect date, says 2007. Um, it's got channel up, channel down, volume up volume down, on and off, and TV, DVD, just to, you know, change in between each one. Yeah, so let's test it out. Okay, so I, um, I've set the infrared channel for the watch. Can't really see. Not crap camera, anyway. Um, you see, you know, it's an extremely old Sanyo TV with the remote control, of course. Um, and yeah, all the buttons are down here. This is gonna get a bit boring, so I'll put into it. Into it. Alright. So let's wait for it. I'm about to press it now. How, how cool is that? Set. Alright. There we go, TV, see? Let's turn the volume up. Oops, I actually turned it off. Alright, the buttons are extremely tiny, and I've got a big thumb, as you can see, it's the same size as the whole watch. So, yeah, turn it on again. Yeah. Alright, channel down. <laughs> Sorry, this TV has got crap reception, trust me, the other TV is better, I'll, sh I'll be showing that one as well show you all the different brands. Alright, turn the volume down. I told you to leave me alone, Trapper. Need you, rat. Turn that right. off. Alright, here is the TV I was talking about. Uh, the better one. It's a Samsung Series 6. There's Samsung there. And actually, a watch remote like this would be quite good if you lose a remote because 
if you also own a Samsung Series 6, you would know that it's awfully painful not having proper buttons, but instead having these touch screen buttons that you, that you can't actually see. So yeah, you have to guess where things are. And I don't, I think I hit something, I'm not sure, but I'll just... Oh, look, done. There we go. Anyway, so off, off, off. Yeah. Anyway, so let's test the watch. I've done the infrared channel again. Now I'm going to TV mode and on. Power on. Alright, take the while to turn on. See why the light's flashing. So bear with me. Success. Alright. Channel up. Um, channel. Let me just check. Oh, right. I have to be pointing at the infrared sensor. Sorry. Ch channel up. Fish oil. Yes. Channel up. McCafe. And more McDonald's. Alright, I think we've got too much oh McDonald's. Sorry. You know, you've got the plus one, plus two channels that aren't probably utilised. Yeah, I'm sure most countries have those. Anyway, so we'll go back down to the McDonald's channel. Um, and it will do volume. Alright, and... I can't help, I can't